Hey guys, what's going on? This is JTEX here coming at you with another episode of the Miner's Protocol. And, um, I guess... Yeah, I really don't know what to say right now because I'm super, super, super salty over the fact that I ended up dying for Syndicate's uh, Parallel Challenge Island Race uh, sort of thing. So I'm a little bit upset about that. I, I don't know. I wanted it to, like, go a little bit longer and I thought I was just doing so good because I got set back episode one because of my idiocracy and well I mean things just kind of spiraled out of control right there did I end up creating a golden apple I don't know maybe I found this in a cave or something um, or um, a mob mob spawner area uh, but yeah so I'm a little bit super salty that I was unable to um, I guess complete the challenge but you know what I, I guess shit happens I'll, I'll think about something other to do than um, what my solo survival series is right now. I may get back into some multiplayer videos with like um, Mindplex and the Hive and stuff like that, like what I used to do. I've been taking a really, really, really long break uh, from things like that, especially since I started the Parallel Islands Challenge. When I started that, I uh, didn't think it'd take this long, but it's been a couple, couple weeks, I believe, since I've done a multiplayer video and I need to get one of those out. I guess is what you were to say. But for today, we are going to finish up uh, this half of my farm, uh, per se, I guess you would call it. Since we do have um, a lot of the supplies needed, we have like a bunch of wheat and stuff like that. We need to get this farm going. Uh, I do not want this piece right there. Active. Uh, and then, uh, you know what? I can walk on this. Yeah, there's no need for, for me to destroy it. Why would I be destroying it? It's super weird. Okay, so we are going to go ahead and just do the entire land area. I was thinking about like, oh, let me create myself a path. But I was like, wait, there's no need to because you don't really hurt um, plants walking on them, do you? Like last I, last I recall, it's only when you like jump on them is when they actually get hurt. So, or uh, turn into non whatever that stuff is. So, went ahead and turned those back into uh, the respective blocks that I was looking for. We're going to fill this up over here and finish it off since I got stairs right here. Or one stair. I guess you would call it one stair. Yeah, one stair. We're going to actually move this over to um, to right here. Here, there we go. This will be a lot better. All right, and we got my stair. No, wait. Where did my stair go? Wait a minute. Oh, it went in the side there. I swear I, I saw it go in my inventory. I, I, th I thought I saw it wouldn't go in my inventory. So I was a little bit confused and I didn't see it there. I was like, did it just delete out of my inventory? What's going on? Um, sorry, excellent. We got this going. We are going to go ahead and plant a, a lot of these down and wrong ones where my seed's at. Uh, seeds, there you are. I, was, I thought I was like, wait, I, I thought I got you like right before the episode started. I, I came in here to, to make sure that the... Uh, that I was going to be able to plant these. But we are going to get this process going a lot quicker because um, I don't want to wait too long um, for for everything to start. I only got six seeds from that. What the heck? That is super weird. That, that I Did they nerf this or something? Because when I was watching Syndicate's Parallel Islands Challenge, he even got like a negative return in seeds. Like he had like, he had three planted. Um, and he got two back, I think, is, is what it was. I, I'm not too for sure. I don't recall exactly 100%. So, um, I don't know if they updated it, but, I mean, once he got that negative return, I think he just got bad luck or something. But, like, now that I got that negative return that one time, um, I'm just a little bit curious is about, like, did they update that or something? Because usually you always, always get a positive return. But, all right, so now we got a steady income of food, which is super good. I have myself everything going good for me. I mean, I got, I got myself uh, a house very much completed. And, uh, oh, I can also get a bed. If you guys didn't know, last episode, I ended up killing some sheep. So that way I can get myself a bed. So let me go ahead and do that real quick. We're going to grab some of the spruce wood, uh, lay it down like so. And we are going to bring uh, the wool over it. So that way I can get myself a beautiful bed so we can stop dying because of how stupid we are. Because apparently JTAX just loves to die. I don't know why he just... For some reason, he loves to die, and we need to get our bed so we don't have to continue flying all the way back. And yes, I fly back because um, I'm not going to travel like a thousand blocks. I mean, I'll probably die, to be honest. Like, if I were to sprint over here, it's just a time saver, really. I'm not cheating anything. It's just really a time saver. If it bothers you that much, let me know down in the comment section below, and I'll be sure to ship you uh, some tissues so that way you can cry. Um, but anyways, 
We are going to kill a skeleton up here. We do need some more bones, which would be really nice. We are also going to uh, journey out just a tad bit uh, to the far lands to see if we can find ourselves. Um, oh, there's a there's a spider over here. Hello, Mr. Spider. How are you doing today? I need your string. Thank you. Um, we could make a fishing pole out of that. That's why I really wanted it. But we want to journey out just a tad bit and see what's around uh, my fabulous looking seed. I mean, just look how beautiful this thing is. It's just gorgeous. I want to get up there. Um, I don't know what to call that thing yet, like the the plateau or whatever. I don't I don't know. Give me something to name that, guys. Like, give me an idea or something. Like, not. Yeah, you get you, you understand what I mean. But we are gonna go ahead and make a crafting table. I want to get some of this gravel picked up, uh, so that way I can um, use it for like pathing way and like decorative design back at my house. So we are gonna go ahead and make ourselves a shovel. There we go. Uh, we ended up breaking our shovel before we started recording. I was uh, gathering up some dirt. And clearing out some of the land and my shovel ended up breaking uh, so that's unfortunate so we're gonna go ahead and create ourselves a new one and pick up this gravel um, and what I like I said what I'm gonna use for this gravel is just basically landscaping I want to make a path uh, for walking uh, since like dirt really doesn't like decay or I guess quote-unquote decay uh, the more you walk on it this will give it more of that um, naturally scenery aspecty type of feel I guess I don't know what you were to call it exactly but I mean hey it's gonna look really beautiful and uh, I got some really cool plans in stock but I got 60 I got 60 from that so that's super cool alright we are gonna go ahead and grab uh, I don't have an axe either that's extremely unfortunate uh, I think I wanna cry just a tad bit we're gonna go ahead and throw the weed on the ground and we're gonna pick this up uh, not worry about the wheat too much I have like five pieces of bread I don't really need the wheat since I got like a bunch of other stuff um, growing back at my farm so that's actually super good and let's see what's head over here I've been over here before um, when I was when I went to the sheep over there like I, I kind of went over to that right there that tree and I saw all of this over here and I was like oh that's cool I need to explore that sometime and that's what I'm doing like right now obviously as you can tell but um, it, it's getting pretty pretty unknown at this point because my render distance yeah it's not that far see I wouldn't be able to see it over here but um, oh, we got some more gravel over here. Hmm. We don't really need this poppy, and I mean, like, hey, we get we can get bone meal from, like, skeletons whenever we want to, like, regrow, um, flowers. So we're going to go ahead and get rid of that poppy, so that way we have room to be able to get, uh, this stuff. And, I mean, we're just not going to worry about that. And we got a bunch of lava over here, too. I mean, hmm. That's too far up. I do need a trash can, but, like, yeah, like I said, that's too far up. I'm not really interested in getting that lava. Um, I'd work too much for it. Okay, so what do we got over here? It looks like we got oak wood. We got uh, spruce wood as well. Nothing too cool. This is a uh, tall spruce wood forest jungle biome thing. Quote on, I'm confused. What is this? I've never seen something like this before. Okay, interesting. These are some really, really interesting trees over here. Oh, do we have a cave system? No, we just have water that's done, um, gone drunk. Let's go ahead and check out this forest system. I'm pretty intrigued. Maybe there's a Maybe there's a jungle around here. I don't know if this is just another type of uh, spruce wood biome, but I mean, hey, it'd be pretty cool if there was something over here. All right, we got some cows. Um, I threw the wheat on the ground. That's that's super unfortunate. Uh, crap. Okay, what can I get rid of? Uh, the emerald, of course. <laughs> <laughs> just toss the emerald on the ground, JTX. Just do it. Why did I not leave this gold back at my place to smelt? Um. Hmm. You know what? Let's just go ahead and throw away the steak. Uh, why am I throwing this away? Or uh, the, not the steak, the stick. Why am I throwing this all away? Oh, Podzol! Um, hmm. Podzol is a soil that doesn't grow grass on it. It'll forever stay dirt. Like this is this, this is Podzol, and I don't I don't know what this is. I forgot what it was called. But it's like dirt never grows on it. Like no matter how long, I think is what it is. So. That would be actually pretty cool if I just put this uh, as my pathway instead of gravel. Oh, hang on. What's this? Is there? Is this just moss cobblestone? I think moss cobblestone just spawns randomly in the worlds now. Okay. Um, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and pick it up and maybe change the texture to this moss cobblestone because this lime green color is just not too appealing. I really want it to be more of a darker color because, I mean, you know, dungeons and stuff is where this stuff is like where we, where we kind of like relate this to to um moss cobblestone we, we kind of relate it to dungeons and stuff like that it's kind of like stamped in our head since 
Uh, that's where most of us started playing. I know they implemented a patch to where the stuff starts spawning naturally because a lot of people are like, oh, moss stone looks super pretty for like designs and stuff like that. I wanna, I wanna use it, make it spawn naturally, and then they got this, they got this beautiful, beautifulness going on right here. Super cool. I like what they did, but um, it doesn't give it the dungeony type of feel, I guess you would call it. So, it's whatever. Okay. Uh, what's over here on th nothing really we got a bunch of moss stone still uh, a bunch of trees There's nothing really over here. I don't really need the trees to be honest I don't need the stone I grabbed a few blocks just in case I'll have an idea of what I want for it in the future uh, But I'm not really gonna grab a bunch of it um, I'm gonna go ahead and also pick some of this stuff up. We actually have about 50 blocks Already so that's good there we go, 50 blocks. Nope, I knew what I was doing. Calculated it 100%. All right, let's go ahead and pick this up, and we'll head back to my house after we get after we get these right here. There we go, excellent. Now let's head back to my house, and um, hopefully we can... Ooh, what's over here? I thought I saw something green. Oh, just a plant and coal. Don't really need it. Um, I have no room in my inventory, so I'm not too worried about... Maybe let's see if I eat this bread and I get room in my inventory. I don't think I will. Yeah, I definitely will I'll just I'll finish off the bread polish it off just a tad bit. There we go Excellent, and uh, I guess for the remainder of the episode. Let's go ahead for the last five minutes. We'll go ahead and uh, Get back to the house and start uh, excavating down into the wonderful uh, Delicious cave systems to see if we can find ourselves some diamonds. That would be awesome for the last five minutes It'd be super cool, and uh, I think I'd like it a lot. Okay. Alright, and uh, you know we're just going to teleport because we're going to waste a bunch of time doing this, so I'll see you guys there. Whoop! Talk about sexy transition, if I do say so myself. But hey guys, let's go ahead and continue on my epic journey. We did clean out my inventory just a tad bit whilst you were not watching my screen uh, during that time. Uh, but we are going to go ahead and head back down here, and uh, the reason I cleaned out my inventory is so that way I could clean up all these wonderful, delicious items down here without uh, too much trouble of like, oh, what do I leave behind? What do I keep? And then and, and whatnot. So it'd be super cool. Uh, actually, wait, let's see. Okay, here we go. This is the way down. Uh, what's my Y at right now? 57. Wow, that is uh, pretty far behind. I thought I was thought I was further down than this. This is super weird. It might take me a little bit to travel downwards. Well, never mind. Just kidding. Hello, zombie. How are you doing today, sir? It is a beautiful day outside, if I do say so myself. Let me just go ahead and give you a nice big hug. Oh, man, I loved it, too. Thank you very much, Jared. Goodbye. Have a nice day. Okay, we're going to continue heading down, guys. We're at level 36 right now. We need to get to level uh, 12. That is the goal that I'm looking for, and uh, we'll go ahead and strip mine that and see what we'll... Oh, wait, yeah, I found a, a mob spawner. So let me go ahead and... and uh, there's a little shit right here. I hate these things so much. They pack a punch of a big zombie, but they're uh, super hard to hit. That's super, super, super hard to hit. We got a creeper posse, so that's actually super no, Mr. Mr. Little Shit. That is not nice. Uh, you almost killed me. You knocked me into the creepers. That would have been super sad if I were to die. Oh my god. Okay, we uh, we need to get this from stop spawning things. So yeah, there we go. Uh, I really thought I made that. Well then, uh, definitely did not come from, what is the point of this right here? If you guys are just gonna spawn randomly, I don't like that, just please stop. I mean, the delicious experience is beautiful, but what if some, something comes up behind me? Like, I got iron armor too, so you, you don't really hurt that much. You don't hurt as much as you can. I mean, like, it kinda hurts just a tad bit. I mean, like, seriously, yeah, it does, but, I mean, other than that, really, you guys kinda tickled me. I just need to get... I, you, you don't tickle me yet. I take it back. You don't tickle me yet. But once I get myself my diamond armor, you will tickle me. And uh, just just you wait. Once I get my diamond armor, everything will be delicious and beautiful. Uh, but I only have a few minutes to find my diamond armor. We are on uh, level 25 right now. So we're going to head a little bit deeper down into our wonderful uh, cave system here that we got going on. Um, I think I saw it go downwards over here. Ah, there we go. Uh, we got some gold right there. I saw that to my left. I'm not going to worry too much about the gold. Um, I want to see if I can get some diamonds before this episode ends. I don't I don't think I will, but hey, you know what? It's worth a shot. All right, let's go ahead and grab this bucket of water just in case we do uh, come in contact with some lava. We'll have an emergency source ready for... Um, 
for clearing these things out. But let's just go ahead and see if we can find some diamonds before this episode ends. We are on episode, we are on uh, level 14. I know that it isn't level 12 and uh, quote unquote like not the most, um, not the uh, most efficient way to do diamonds. But we are going to head down anyways because I'm second guessing myself. But let's just go ahead and see what we can do in the next minute or so. So... I hope this goes really well. We got some redstone. That's actually super nice. I, I don't mind redstone at all. Uh, but we are looking for diamonds. I really, the reason I'm looking for diamonds, I want to get into the nether. That is my objective is to get into the nether. Um, oh, oh, silver. Ooh, there's a, there's a fortress around here. Oh, uh, stronghold, not fortress. I swear I thought, well, Is there actually a stronghold around here, or do they actually just kind of randomly spawn as well? 